Hey, I'm John Tempesta. I'm here to talk about my signature snare drum from Tama. Uh, the drum is a 7x14, 2mm brass drum. I've been using this snare drum as my main drum for the last five years. Um, I had it when I was with Helmet. Uh, I use it with the Cult. I use it for live as well as recording. And it works out perfectly for me because it has everything I want out of a drum. It has the meat, it has the crack, so I could get the sound of a metal drum as well as the sound of a wood drum. So it works perfectly for me in any situation. I decided to use uh, die cast hoops on this drum. I always play die cast because I, I'm a loud player and uh, these hoops definitely keep the drum in tune. But what I love about this drum is um, it's very versatile. I could tune it down, put a muffler on it and get that real fatness or just keep it wide open and crank it as high as I can go. When I was playing with Helmet, this was, uh, this was perfect because we wanted something really ringy, so I tuned this as high as I could go with it, but keeping the snares fairly loose, and it was perfect for that. The cool thing Tama did was they made it in a black brush nickel finish, which I was pretty blown away by. I didn't expect it, and I just love the look of the drum. Um, the hoops, the lugs, it's all nickel, and as well as the snares, they made these black nickel snares as well. So the whole drum is black inside and out. That's kind of called stealth because it's pretty mean and dark looking. It took me a little bit to come up with a cool badge design. You know, I've looked at different snare drums. Um, but I wanted something that really stick out and pop. Uh, my brother and I came up with this concept, just like the JT, almost like a racing car symbol. And uh, I wanted something to pop off the black nickel finish, and I thought red would be the perfect color. So I'm really happy to, at the end result. I couldn't be happy where Tama came up with my signature snare drum. It has everything I've always wanted in the drum. It has the look, the sound. Um, I don't think I've, I would ever play anything else. So this is definitely the snare drum for me.